<laughs> oh my god! What the? Ugh. <laughs> you want to smell it? He's already excited about the cheese, so am I. This is the Two Hungry Bros. And we are going to be trying many different weird cheeses that we found at Aldi today. Uh, and, and what? Well, it wouldn't be complete without little red wine in the cat and that's why you try cheese. So today we have Fon Fontina cheese, which is very soft. Whiskey maple gouda. We got double cream brie. Honey lemon, Gouda, <laughs> Borgonzola, Camembert. We got the Somerdale Cotada Bocetta. I can't pronounce that Gouda. That's Meriki. Meriki Gouda. Yep, Meriki Gouda. And the last one is Robusto. Robusto. All right, so <laughs> what do you want to try first? Uh, I'll give you first pickings. Try a whiskey one. Whiskey maple gouda. I'm not cutting the cheese with the shears. I'm just opening up the plastic with the shears. You got to go traditional with it. Smell that. Mmm, not bad. All right. You can cut the cheese. All right, who cut the cheese? <laughs> <laughs> There's that. There's that. It looks like fucking cheesecake. <laughs> All right, ready? Here we go. All right, so this is whiskey maple gouda. And I can already taste the whiskey in it. Yeah. Right off the bat. That ain't bad. It tastes with a uh, maple too. A tad bit of maple, but not much. All right, your turn to pick. All right. So that one, I'll give that one about a three on the five scale. It was all right. It was good. Yeah. All right. So next one, I'll do the Fontina cheese. Apparently I'm missing one of the cheeses. We got a surprise cheese, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy, it's gonna be fun. <clears throat> she hid one of the cheeses. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> All right, so Fontina cheese looks very weird. Oh, we also have garden vegetable with sweet basil. All right, here we go. Rhino, right so I can get a good piece. This one's very soft and whatnot. So, Fontina, here we go. Yum! Not bad. That's really good. <laughs> Try the garden vegetable with sweet basil. The semi soft cheese. Ah. Okay. So this one kind of looks like it got rolled in the dirt. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Kind of looks like mold a little bit. Can you use the red wine as a palate cleanser? <laughs> oh my god. God! What the? Ugh. <laughs> you want to smell it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think 
you to first try it. Okay, so here we go. You dick. <laughs> Had to pick this one. <laughs> hey, where's the... You get that piece of... <laughs> oh, good God. Just gave me all the basil. That's all you did. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Cheers. Some of the stinkiest cheese is the best taste of freaking cheese. I'll have to admit, this is pretty good. <laughs> oh, you got bad. That's not one that I'd regularly eat, though. <clears throat> My wife is definitely gonna have fun with all this cheese. She's gonna be <laughs> stuffed up worse than a turkey on Thanksgiving. No, I'm gonna make macaroni and cheese with all the funky cheeses. Okay. So that was the uh, garden basil. Garden vegetable. Garden vegetable sweet basil semi soft cheese. All right, so next up, I will pick the Irish cheese. It's not Italian because Italian is red. But this one's orange. Could you imagine a Jamaican cheese? <laughs> hey, it's all good, Amon. <laughs> it's all good. It's probably full of weed. Oh my God. <laughs> That's <laughs> it. exist for a reason. Okay, so I just peeled off the orange rind. So there's a good access point. All right, here we go. It's a crumble. Right. There's that. All right. Take a sip. Cheers. Oh. Cheers. So this one's a Summerdale Clotada Bochetta. It has like a crunchiness into it. Like a little crunch. Like you don't even notice it until like the last minute. There's like that little fucking crunch. Yep, right there. And again. <laughs> Did you notice a crunch? A little bit. <laughs> All right. What's your next one? Uh, let's try this one. The camber. Cam. Cam. How do you want to say it? Camber. He likes cutting the cheese, by the way. Oh, do I <laughs> love cutting the cheese? <laughs> Now you might think this looks like it's unwrapped, or what have you, and this does look like paper. Is it paper, or is that actual cheese? Is that the brie? No, camembert. Camembert. It's really soft. It's a rind. It's a rind? Yeah. And it's a bitch to get off. Same with the brie, it'll be the same way. Okay. Well, I don't know a whole lot about fancy cheeses, so this is why this is gonna be fun. Try to use scissors. God, it's like that toilet paper you have in the toilet when you flush it. That's what it fucking feels like. Feels like wet toilet paper? Feels like wet toilet paper. Gross. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Right down the side of it. Fuck it. Let's do that. Cut it. Alright, so there's the camber. Oh my god, that looks incredible. Alright. That's creamy. Yeah, it's supposed to be creamy. Alright, here we go. Eat the rind. You, uh, you do or you don't? You do not want to eat the rind. The rind is horrible. Alright. Okay. So I got my piece through that whole process. There's yours. So this is camembert. We're going to try not to eat the rind, but. Might have to because it's probably stuck on there. Yeah. Alright, so here we go.
You know, past the rind that tastes like Play Doh. <laughs> no taste of Play Doh. This is pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. It ain't that bad. It honestly tastes like egg whites. Just pure fucking egg whites. There's no cheese flavor. That one looks like a fucking diaper because it tastes like one. Ugh. Uh, your turn. <laughs> yeah, sure. Borgonzola? Borgonzola. There's that one. There's another Gouda. Or Bata. The blue berry. Very fresh. <laughs> Alright, so we can do the uh, honey, honey lemon. lemon. Honey lemon. We'll go ahead and uh, do this one next. My wife decided to help me out by eating some of this before. <laughs> yeah, I tried to tell you before you just uh, wasted some of it. It's a crumble cheese, so you can actually crumble a piece off. Okay. So, <laughs> one, two, three, crumble cheese. They're designed to be put in salads. I can tell. Mm-hmm. You can taste the lemon. Highly taste the lemon. I can't taste the honey in it whatsoever. That one was all right. I'm not gonna lie. All right, what next? Uh, let's try the rubasta. Rubasta. Okay. Give me three left. Should brought my knife. Okay, so here we go. So Robusta kind of looks like Swiss with candle wax. All right, here we go. Oh, cheese, very like intense. Robusto. Just, just no. Mm -hmm. 100% no. Worse than magic potion? <laughs> there ain't nothing worse than that fucking magic potion candy. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. Okay. So there's three cheeses left. So I guess we'll just go from the top. We'll do a uh, Maraki Gouda. That was like Swiss too. Oh shit, it's already falling apart. <laughs> This one ain't too bad. Uh -uh. Better than the uh, other one. Oh yeah. This one actually triggers my saliva glands. <laughs> they're spitting the cheese out a bit. Spitting the cheese. We're cutting it, then we're spitting it. Yo. That one's good. I'm gonna I'm gonna clean up all this after we're doing this, so we're good. I'm thoughtful. <laughs> All right. Next up is Borgonzola. Borgonzola. And again, this one has the wet toilet paper rind on it. I don't think it's bad as the other one. So we'll just redneck it. Oh my. Oh no, it's blue cheese. Oh God, no. <laughs> 
what am I doing to myself? Oh! Oh, oh my... I can barely smell it. Take a whiff. Do it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here we go. I made, I made worse. Do it. Ready? Not bad. No. I was very surprised. Blue cheese is pretty good, actually. <laughs> regularly, regular, regular, folks. Regular eating wouldn't do it, but if it was fancy like this, bacon, pick you up. That's why he's not allowed to go to wine tastings with me. <laughs> All right, so the last one is Brie. And again, it's one of those fucking special toilet paper rind cheeses. Why not have to get those no more? All right. Oh my God. Early salt cheese. So the breeze almost kind of like the camembert. Don't eat that. And the other one. There you go. All right, here we go. This Three, is brie. Two. One, two. Maraki Gouda, that one. All right, guys. So this was a very interesting, interesting 200 bros, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye. Sure to like and subscribe to the Fun Crab channel, and remember to hit that notification bell to be alerted for our next videos. And thank you for watching. <laughs>